This is a me thing, not a we thing. Everything is a you thing. Oh, happy day for you, Eddie Brock. Hmm, what a scoop. The end of the magical misery tour. I worry for your soul. How will you live with the weight of snuffing out a man's life? I was, uh, I was hoping maybe you could give me a couple pointers. <laughs> Funny little guy, aren't you? Don't need that. My memory is outstanding. Rude. Consequences. Every decision you ever make. Who do we leave behind? How do we leave them? A connubial bed, empty, waiting in the darkness for the rescuer who never comes because of you. This guy makes zero sense. You and I are the same. No, no we're not. Twisted insides, mean daddies. You feel like home to me, Eddie, like family. And really, truly, that is all I ever wanted in this world, family. Well. Killing your grandmother and your mother sure is a funny way of showing it. Anything you want to unburden yourself with before. And this happens? Yes. I have wishes to bestow upon you. Oh, that is kind. I want to wish you this heartbreak. Uh oh, too late. I wish for you to see out your days alone as you always have been. Watch it, pal. Where, where are you going with this? You are a cancer to everyone who ever loved you, Eddie. Deceived your trusting fiance. And no wonder daddy could never look at you again after you killed his wife, your mother just by being born. You son of a bitch! No, 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 no! Treat my friend again like that! I dare you! Ah! Hey, hey! Ah! Not touching the inmate! Hey, back up! Eddie? You're done. I have tasted blood before, my friend, and that is not it. Eddie? Brock has a big secret. Shut up, Cassidy. 